The question I get asked a lot is, do I need to look at my audience during my presentation? Yes! Where else are you going to look? Well, actually a lot of people will spend the time looking at the clock on the back wall, or looking at the ceiling, or looking at the floor, or looking at their notes, or looking around them. In fact, looking anywhere but at their audience. And yet eye contact is vital. If you want your presentation to be listened to, if you want people to pay attention, and particularly if you want people to act in some way on what you're saying. Now the trick here isn't to go around trying to make individual eye contact with every single person of the audience. Just let your eye drift around the room, whether that's a meeting room with half a dozen people in, or it's a big conference hall, maybe with people sat on a balcony above you or sat in a big space in front of you. Just let your eye drift around the room to make sure that everybody gets eye contact from you from time to time. And you don't have to uh, really concentrate on individuals. Just look at the crowd as a whole, but make sure you're looking at the whole crowd. It's very easy, particularly if somebody is sat there smiling at you, to look at one person and just deliver to them, but that excludes everybody else. So to look around the room. Make sure you're looking at the back row just as much as you're looking at the front row who might be in front of you, because you want them all to be involved and engaged. In fact, I say it's probably more important to make eye contact with the back row because they are that much further from you. Obviously, they're distant, and by making eye contact with them, you can bring them in and include them far more. So eye contact is really vital. Spread it around, spread the love with your eyes, make contact with people, keep engaged with them, and they will keep engaged with you.